obviously now I can't try the dresses on because they're not my property but you can see how they look um, yeah so I got this she wanted the caramel one because she's already got one in red and she wanted the caramel one so let's just put the hanger in it so well I think it looks like caramel colour yeah oh, do you know what I've got one of those things that you know every I don't know 20 minutes or so it blows out air freshener you know the ones I mean and I swear to you every single time it frightens the life out of me even if I'm expecting it it still makes me jump anyway this is the dress and like I say, it's about to the knees, yeah, and it's just got that notched v-neck detail, and it's really nice, the buttons going all the way down, but they're not like buttons you can open, yeah, they're not like buttons you can open, just for the detail, and elasticated um, cuff. Yeah, really nice, you know, really nice. And it's in a 1XL, it's from the sh from Sheen. No, sorry, it's in an XL. Um, so that's that colour. So I think XL is size 16, isn't it? And then she ordered a second one. Where's that gone? Here we go. And it's the same dress, just the Adam in a variety of colours. Yeah, and this one is gorgeous. I was thinking I might get one in this colour myself. But it's an absolutely beautiful colour. And here it is. Isn't that a lovely blue? It's really nice. Sorry if the lighting's a bit dark. But it's just the same design. Um, yeah, in a baby blue colour, yeah, and really nice, you know, and again, that's in a size XL from Sheen, so the baby blue one, let me say, the baby blue one, that's £11.49, £11.49, um, the khaki one that's the color they say khaki one the other one that this one sorry i'm all over flutter today this one uh this one was in the sale uh and it was eight pound 56 yeah it was in the sale and it's eight pound 56 but i think the sale ends in a couple of hours so it'll go back to its normal price which was probably 13.99 so just be careful you know because prices tend to change all the time on these you know when you're buying things from these places so that's the two things from Sheen and then uh, this is for me and it's a coat you're probably thinking she's bought another coat well I have my friends I have and I thought it was a good bargain to be to be honest with you and uh, yeah so it's a big a big coat yeah and it's got like black lining in it the cuffs are black. I will put a picture so you can see it, you know, before I try it on.
Okay, now we're going on to Primark. Okay, listen. The last Primark, remember when I showed you that um, baby blue, cornflower blue, whatever blue you want to call it, the little biker jacket. Yeah, remember that one? Well, I figured I saw one in cream. And I thought, well, it would be rude not to. So there it is. It's lovely. Pretty much like the um, the blue one, but just cream. I think it's cream. Yeah, cream. And it's in an XL. And again, it was £17. Yeah, and I love this silver detail going on. Yeah. So nice. I do, I like it. I didn't see any other colours in it though, just the blue and the cream. I didn't even see any blue ones left. Yeah, and I got some uh, of this. It's £3. It's PS Superfood Raspberry Overnight Lip Mask. So there's something going on with my lips and it's annoying me. But it just comes in this. Just comes in this little pot. Yeah. And sealed, so we like that. Let's see. Oh. It smells like, um, remember the bazooka chewing gums? Oh. <laughs> so that's what it is. Like I say, I've not tried it yet, but I'll let you know. Mmm, that smells good. And that was, again, just £3. And you get quite a lot in there, actually. So, yeah. I like that. Uh, what else did I get? Um, right, I got some of this vitamin C eye serum. And that was £3.50. Yeah, I've got like um the this is the eye serum so i've now got that i've got the vitamin c serum i've got um the face moisturizer yeah so i'm trying to see if i can find the vitamin c facial wash as well yeah, so I've got my little skincare routine going. Like I say, I want to find the facial wash in this. And I do like using Lacura skincare as well. So um, it's either one or the other. Okay, so I got these cushions. Aren't they cute? Who don't yeah. like... Oh, that bloody thing. Who doesn't like a bit of furry cushionness? They don't have any zips on them, so you can't take like it off and wash the cover. But I just think it's beautiful. I got it from Primark Home with all the little silvery bits on it. Yeah, it was £4. But then it went well. Yeah, it was £4, but it went down to 2 So when I got to the till, it was just £2. So I got not just one, but I got two. Yeah, so they both went down to £2 each. I don't know why that one hasn't got a sticker. But yeah, lovely. And they had them in cream and... Uh, purple or lilac yeah so I thought these would look really nicely on my settee very nice so not bad for two pounds but the other colors they were all in four pounds so hopefully you know some of those might go down in price as well 
Okay, coming to the end now, two more things. I saw this, I don't know where the tag's gone, but it was one pound. And I just like, I just like the look of it. Yeah, just a little woman. Gosh, you wouldn't want boobs like that, eh? <laughs> but I thought that's nice. You could just even stick a little rose in there. You know, and they had them in white as well. So I thought that's nice. And the last thing is uh, this Primark candle. And it's lovely. The container is gorgeous. You can use that like a little vase or something. Yeah, it's absolutely beautiful. And what... Uh, what fragrance is it? It doesn't say. Does it? Linen Cabana. So kind of like a fresh linen -y taste. Yeah, I've not took the, the little thing off. I hope it smells, you know, nice when you burn it. Because I've been buying Aldi candles and I'm just, I, d I, d I can't smell them. I don't know if something's gone wrong with me uh, sense of smell, I don't know. I mean, it smells nice, you know, it smells really nice. If you like that linen fresh smell. So, I'm keeping my fingers crossed. It was £6 for this. But I think that's probably for the container as well so yeah I'm gonna have to stop buying Aldi candles because you know they are a bit of a letdown but fingers crossed for this and I just love that container so there you go that's all my Primark things yeah then I'm gonna show you what I got from Amazon and this is just the box because I've taken it out of the box um, here we go and it is a Tassimo Suni coffee maker yeah there you go you can probably see it better like that and I thought to myself why not girl why not and I love it I love it you can, you know, you can get the pods. Because I bought the wrong pods for them. I bought the pods that probably go into the Gusto one. And you need the, the, the thinner pods. But yeah, I managed to get some. And I absolutely love it. I absolutely love it. Like I said, I did get it off Amazon. Those um, are some of the pod flavours you can get. There's one that says Oreo, Oreos, but I'm not really an Oreos fan, to be honest. But I do like this. I will put the price up, um, but yeah, I'm very happy with it. They had it in cream and in black. This is a close-up of the Bosch coffee machine, and it's really nice. I really like it. So this bit here, that's your drip tray and you can take it out yeah and depending on the size of your cup so you can have it there or you can have it in that one or if you've got a big cup then you can take it out all together you've got this part that lifts up like that and you put your pods in and the pods look like that I did originally buy the wrong pods but yeah and this you put this pod in first this is like your creamer pod so you just put it in like that and then you close this down yeah and then that will make the the first part of it and then the second bit with the coffee yeah this is like for the coffee part and again you take that other one out put that one in and uh close it press it and you get the coffee going into it 
So yeah, it's really nice. I like it, it's easy. And then you've got the water thing at the back, so I'll show you that. This is the water, where you keep the water, you put it in. You've got a little thing that says maximum, so you don't go over there. And that just slots in behind. Yeah, so if I just put this down, where that little bit is up, you just slot it down there and push that back down. Yeah? And I think it's really nice. So I will just show you how I make a nice cup of coffee. Okay, so I'm going to put this back in. Just there. Right, that just slots in. Then I've got my cup. That goes there. Um, yeah, so I bought these. They're like pods for the Bailey's latte macchiato so it's with cream liqueur um but without the alcohol yeah so i've got the creamer so that one's going to go in first yeah lock that down turn it on and just wait process is starting there we go Okay. So that's the first part. Okay. And then we just undo here. Take that pod out. And uh, we put this one in. Close it again, all the way down, and press here, and just wait. There we go. bit at the end. So it doesn't fill the cup the cup up all the way but I guess you could put another one in if you wanted to fill it right up. And that process is done. So any other bits will be caught in the drip tray and that's my coffee. Yeah, I just normally give it a stir and yum yum. So I'm I'm happy with that. And the last thing is what I bought from Aldi. I will put footage in of me using the coffee maker and this product. Well, not using this this product, but you know, just showing you it. And it is this. It's the dual air fryer. I saw it in because the last time I did an Aldi haul, I got the Aldi magazine, and I saw it in there, and I thought, "You're mine, you're mine." So you know, 
waited patiently till Sunday. That's when they were getting them in. And I just, because I'm very lucky, Aldi's just about five minutes down the road. Yeah, ten minutes if you walk. <laughs> as slow as I do. But yeah, I went in and I saw them straight away and I thought, I'm putting one in my trolley now. Do you know what I mean? Because they sold out that Sunday. But yeah, it's really nice. The sleekness, I love the black. And it's got its two baskets. And yeah. I've not fully read through the manual yet. But um, I will. And yeah. I've just wanted one, one of those dual basket ones. They did have a single basket one, which was for 40, no, 39.99. That one was in cream. I didn't see it in Aldi, but it was probably there because they were both coming in on the same day. I'm really pleased with it. It was 64.99, which I think is pretty, a pretty good price. You know, I was in Aldi and a couple was passing me and they went, oh, is that an air fryer? Is that a jewel air fryer? <laughs> and I was like, yeah. They're like, oh, I bet they've sold out now. I said, no, they're just there near the first till. They went, right, we're just going to put our shopping away, then we're going to go and get it. And true to the word, they went, cheers, love. But yeah, a really good bargain. It says oil free frying. So, you know, for those who want to cook without using oil. Yeah, and it also, I'm just reading the top of the box. It also says, yeah, the baskets are four litre ones. So I'll pop a little bit of footage so you can see it. So this is the air fryer and I absolutely love it. As you can see, it's got its uh, drawers. Yeah. I did do some chips in it. So, I'm going to do something else in it and then I'm going to wash it. But the thing is, these things don't come out. And it seems a bit harder, a bit hard to wash it. They say soak it in warm soapy water. But it doesn't, you know, there's nowhere for this bit to come out. Yeah, it's, I don't understand. You know, I don't want to break it and I've just got it. So, I'll have to work that out. But, you know, it's nice. And then just switch it on. Yeah, and you can see it's got the little, sorry, it's got a bit of uh, dust on it. So you can see that on-off button. So just press it. There we go. See, I'm still learning. But you've got all your bits up here, your chips, your chicken, your chops, cakes, fish and all kinds of things. I think that's a kebab. Yeah. And it's got the degree centigrade and the minutes so you can change all those. And you can press pair and you can start, use both of the baskets. So yeah, I really like it. You know, and it saves on time and energy. You know, you turn the cooker on and you're like five pounds down on electricity already. So I really like this. I might do a video where, you know, I just do different, try and find different meals that I can cook in the air fryer that I've not done before. So, yeah, but I really think at 64.99, this is a good investment. So, well done, Aldi. Yeah, along with the coffee maker. But that's all my bits. I hope you've enjoyed this video. And I thank you if you've stayed till the end. I truly appreciate it. You know, if you would like to subscribe, come on then. Come on. Come, Ed. I'd love to have you. And, uh, you know, like I say, my channel does love. And I love as well. Thumbs up. It helps to push my videos out there a bit more so um what day is it today it's a tuesday so whatever you're doing with your tuesday have a good one
it is Easter coming soon. Um, yeah, I'm just going to go and chill out now. And uh, I hope you do the same. You know, be good to yourselves and each other. Don't let the negative people win now. They're just jealous. And most of all, let's keep smashing this life. I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Take care, you know, and uh, I'll see you real soon. God bless. Bye for now.